Hey, what's going on guys? Let's go over the bosses and mechanics of the first T2 Abyss Dungeon, Road of Lament. The first boss, Nazan, has one high damage mechanic and another mechanic that can stun players. At 8 and 4 HP bars, Nazan will teleport to the center of the room and create a blood pool directly around him while the rest of the room is safe. Alternatively, he can also fill the entire room with blood and the safe area will be right around the boss. In all the runs that I've done, I've never seen him fill the entire room with blood, so expect the first outcome. When he does this, he will start shooting lasers from his hands and spinning either clockwise or counterclockwise. Just pay attention to which way he's rotating. He will also stop periodically and spin the opposite direction. This is relatively easy to dodge, but if you feel like you don't have enough movement speed, add the robe of swiftness to your bar before the fight begins. During this mechanic, when the blood pool is near the boss, you will also mark players indicated by a crosshair above your character. When this happens, you will drop two magnetic fields onto the arena. If touched, these will stun you and you will more than likely be hit by his spinning attack. Move to the outside of the arena, preferably the corners, to drop these fields so that all players have plenty of room to maneuver during the spinning attack. Let's move on to the second boss, Kaisera. She only has one major mechanic that will happen once she reaches 10 health bars. She'll teleport to the center of the room, and red and yellow orbs will start shooting out from her. Before this fight begins, designate a party member in each direction, north, south, east, and west for this mechanic. Avoid red orbs while collecting three yellow orbs. When you reach three yellow orbs, an aura will spawn around your character. If you happen to get hit by a red orb before you receive the aura, it will negate one of the yellow orbs you collected, and you will need to collect extra yellow orbs. Eventually, red orbs will spawn around the outside of the arena, and they will slowly start to move towards the boss. The only way to kill these orbs is with the aura that you now have. If too many orbs reach the boss, this will wipe the party. She only does this mechanic once. The only other thing to watch out for is one stagger check, use your high stagger abilities, and equip whirlwind grenades if needed. So that's it guys. Hope it helps. I'll see you next time.